What's up guys, in today's video we're going to be talking about a new ground class setup and MP5 loadout for Warzone. Now this loadout is by far one of the best loadouts to be using in Warzone currently before Season 4 drops. Now this also may be the meta, in my opinion, after Season 4 drops as well. We don't really know yet because there's going to be new DLC weapons and stuff like that. But as of right now, this is by far the best loadout to be using in Warzone. But before I get I don't want you guys to subscribe if you're new around here to drop that thumbs up to today's video and to comment down below and tell me what you think about this loadout and what you would personally change about it or if you're going to be using this exact loadout below. Much love once again guys, let's get right into this. So the first thing you want to know for this loadout is you're going to put the growl on for the primary weapon. Now for the actual loadout or actually set up for this growl, you're going to be using the monolithic suppressor with the Tempest 26.4 Archangel Barrel. Then for the underbarrel, you're going to be running the Ranger Foregrip. And then for the ammunition, you're going to be running the 60 round mags. And then for the stock, you're going to be running no stock. Now no stock is a very big game changer here because it increases your ads speed and mobility a lot but you're also gonna be having great recoil control and you're also gonna be having really good range with this exact setup moving along to the secondary weapon where we talk about the mp5 now for the mp5 what i like to run on my setup is the monolithic suppressor with the five milliwatt laser that way you can have better sprint to fire and hip fire accuracy and stuff like that and then i like to run the mark four grip for better recoil control and also hip fire accuracy as well and then i put on the 45 round mags with sleight of hand because sleight of hand does come in handy especially in close range gunfight situations when you're needing to reload fast to keep your gunfight active moving on along to the perks i like to run eod overkill and amp amp is just so you can switch weapons faster eod is because you know people like to spam c4s and especially rockets in warzone for my lethal, I like to run C4 and Heartbeat Sensor. That never really changes, but if there is somebody else in your squad running a Heartbeat Sensor, I would actually change that to some Stun Grenades, because Stun Grenades do actually, honestly, they're pretty much overpowered, in my opinion, in Warzone, because you can barely move at all once you're stunned. But that does it for today's class setup video and stuff like that. I want you guys to tell me down in the comments, as I said below, and tell me if you guys are going to be trying this class setup out exactly how I have it laid out, and tell me what you think about it after you've used it. Much love once again, guys. Peace.